Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Vivs back from Slide Nerd. This is a request from one of the guys on YouTube to make a video on compound interest. So I thought I should go ahead with this. So let's see how this works, shall we? Quick and fast. Output. Enter the amount 5000 bucks. Interest rate 0.05. Number of years 5. And after 5 years, this is what you'll get back. Alright, this is the simple program. So if you guys are wondering how compound interest is calculated, let me show you how the formula works. The amount into 1 plus interest raised to the number of years. If you are thinking how to do this raised to part, it's simple. You have the math dot power function. If you say 3 comma 2, it's gonna calculate 3 square. That's how it works. So I'll use NetBeans for this. Let's quickly get this over with. I have an empty project in NetBeans. So first thing, I need to take 3 inputs and I'll produce one output, right? So let's go and see how that's done. I'll say system dot out dot print ln, copy paste it 3 times. Enter amount. Oops, I copy pasted system dot out dot print ln inside. Enter rate. Enter years. Snuff, I need to take input. I'll use the buffered reader input mechanism for that. If you guys don't know what buffered reader is, you can check the link on this video. So there you go, buffered reader stuff, blah blah blah, pasted. At this point, Mm, why hasn't Java given an error say yet? Alright, so everything is imported. Say throws exception. If you remember, reading from an input may cause an error, so you have to make sure you handle the error. Or if you don't handle the error, ask the compiler to handle it. Enter amount. Double amount, rate, years, and total four variables I'm gonna need for this take them up all right so the amou amount it's going to be something like this reader dot read line reader dot read line takes the input from the user returns it back as a string all right but remember amount is double this is string so we can't convert from string to double we use a function called parse double put this thing inside this parse double is inside a class called double so we say double dot parse double copy paste the same thing for taking the input three times and last but not the least don't forget to change the name of the variables otherwise you'll be in big trouble right there was a time when I had kept the variables as it is and I probably wondered for half an hour what the hell was wrong with my program alright so at this point we have everything ready let's go ahead and calculate stuff we'll say total if you remember the formula, it was something like this, 1 plus rate, this whole thing raised to the power, right, math dot pav, make sure it's a capital M, you'll see years, you multiply this thing by amount, semicolon at the end, and we'll simply print this thing out. Okay, control S for saving, shift F6, run, enter 5000, 0.05, years is 5, we're getting the same 6381, right? So I hope you guys fo followed something out of this program, it was a pretty simple, easy, compound interest stuff. If you like what you saw, please subscribe to my channel, we love hearing from you. Comment, let us know what you think about this. I'll catch you guys later, have a nice day.